supposed to promote an event at a Memphis club has caught the attention of police. The video that you're looking at right there went viral and shows people openly engaging in sex acts at a Southeast Memphis club. The party is promoted by a group called Team Taboo. News Channel 3's Michelle Reese joins us live from Southeast Memphis where the party happened. Michelle. Yeah, the party allegedly happened here on Saturday night at Club Elements. Now, the party was thrown by a group called Team Taboo, as you mentioned. Now, earlier today, we caught up with a member of Team Taboo to ask him some tough questions about this racy party, and we got some surprising answers. This organization that's just for the people of Memphis, people who, you know, don't have family, and we take them in. We do a number of things in the community. Uh, we do, like, Zoo Day. That's how Kenny Lee originally described his organization, Team Taboo, the same group who promoted one of its community functions with this video. It shows young adults popping champagne bottles and engaging in various sex acts. Some so explicit we can't show them on TV. I am not proud of the video. You know what I mean? I was very upset after watching the video myself. Lee originally denounced the video and even wrote a statement to the media saying Team Taboo does not promote anything illegal or demeaning. But after questioning Lee for several minutes, we released the video. He admitted his group did in fact release the video and admits the group's real focus is on the party. We're an organization in the city of Memphis, just like a number of the other organizations. We're just more on the x-rated side i would say that x-rated content captured in this video has captured the attention of local law enforcement they're trying to figure out if any laws were broken at the party held at club elements police chief tony armstrong we're in the process now trying to, to find out exactly what the owners knew what he was uh what, what the information he was privileged to uh and we'll proceed if that uh if we get the right amount of information we'll proceed with the nuisance court we couldn't get hold of Club Elements, but Lee says his group did nothing wrong and everyone at the party was consenting adults. You had to be 18 years of age to get in that party. He also vowed his parties won't be stopping anytime soon. I mean, we are party people. You know what I mean? I mean, we get down. Now, City Councilman Harold Collins says he hopes those parties will soon stop here in Hickory Hill. He says he does not support or condone the behavior in that video and he says he'll be working very hard with law enforcement to make sure those parties come to an end reporting live tonight in hickory hill michelle reese wreg news channel three